you joined this this remade secondary and have been a part of changing the culture on that back end here. From the perception you knew of the Lions before you got here to mm -hmm. now joining this organization, what have you learned about this team? Yeah, man. Um, I mean, even before the perception I had before, uh, you know, just a gritty team. You know, a team that you know is never going to lay down. You know, with any team in this business, you know, week in, week out, you never know what they expect. You never know how they're going to come in and out of the games, in and out of stadiums. Uh, but the, Detroit was always a team that, you know, just always puts the chips in the middle of the table and came at you hard, you know, came at you different ways, made you think, gave you different formations and sets. And um, just from a physicality standpoint, you know, just being around that, you know, you, you love when guys want to be physical back and, and love that back and forth competitive battle. So I always had that great respect and, and great, you know, necessarily love for playing a couple of times that, that interacted with Detroit over the years. And obviously with being in, in, in and now, you know, uh, just a, a, a great carryover. You know, uh, you know, we got great guys in the building, you know, from top down. Um, a lot of a lot of knowledge, a lot of knowledge from a lot of different places, from the secondary, from you know all the different coaches, you know, and and, and that's on both sides of the ball. Yeah. You know, a lot of experienced guys are are getting warm, more warm, yeah. and uh, you know, welcoming into playing 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 together with each other, and um, you know, you know, we're just out here just fine tuning our games, man. You know, we love this game. You know, guys come out here with the same approach each and every day. Um, and just ready to work, man. Just ready to, to prove all, all the doubters or anything else that is said about individually and as it's, as us support a collective. And um, just like I said, we're just ready to, to go every time we step out here on this field. Working together uh, is, a, is a part of, you got a big test against the Giants here this week to go against another team this early within camp. C.J. Gardner-Johnson, man, does not stop talking. <laughs> as entertaining as it was for us to watch it, what's it like being next to him and gelling with him? Because you have a personality to yourself, but uh -huh. his is pretty big, man. <laughs> yeah, man. Uh, you know, that's his energy. You know, everybody everybody in that's to, to each his own. You know what I mean? Uh, whatever gets you juice for the day, you know, whatever gets you riled up, whatever keeps you necessarily within the moment and uh, just ready to go, you know, down in, down out. You know, um, obviously that's, that's receptive and, and accepted, you know, the same as he's giving off, you know. So he he's learning too, to you know how to get around guys and and keep being in it, pushing himself into that leadership role and um, just that exposure to who he is as an individual and you know what what can he do and not necessarily just as a player, but be for these guys as you know human beings too, you know. So um, it's not just all about ball here, you know. In, in any situation, you know, we have to be connected and, and bonded, you know, well well before necessarily stepping out there on the field and you know the the, the football aspect is just a, the next step, you know what I mean. So um, you know just. Still just building a relationship with a lot of the guys, yeah. you know, still just coming together, you know, and that, and that just kind of just push us through week in, week out, you know what I mean? Just having the guys back, so knowing that, you know, we're going to, you know, be responsible um, and, uh, you know, just get the work done, get the job done. I know you can't hit fast forward. You have to put that work in. But with everything that you see in this roster, that you, the part of the work that you're putting in, how badly do you want to get to week one of that man, regular we're, season? We're excited. We're definitely excited. Not to, not to get into the end of that question, but uh, we're, we're definitely excited, man. Um, you know, even then, you still got some limitations with, yeah. you know what I mean, can't get around a quarterback or, you know, kind of just thudding guys up. And um, But like I said, the energy is is, is super contagious you know, on both sides of the ball. And, and that's what you need, that collective offense, defense, special teams, all three phases working hand in hand in hand. And, uh, you know what I mean, just controlling the game, not turning the ball over, but cr but causing turnovers as well. You know what I mean? So a lot of times we get, we get off the field, you know, we get off the field and uh, get, the, get the ball back for offense get them in great position, you know what I mean? They're going to control the game, control the tempo, control the pace, you know, and at the end of that, too, just be able to put up points, too. So, you know, that gives you an extra bounce, you know, in and out of huddles, in and out of stepping out on the field of, you know, all we got to do is give ourselves the opportunity and play our game, play fast, play physical, and, uh, you, know, you know, it would be rewarding in the sense of what we do and then what offense and special teams would do as well. And that's just complimentary football.